Today, voters in Minnesota will decide several key races, including who will be our next governor. It's a race our exclusive Survey USA poll found is a dead heat. With such a tight race, too, there's a last-minute push to sway the undecided. Five Eyewitness News reporter Robert Moses is live with how the candidates are spending Election Day. Good morning, Robert. Rebecca, good morning to you. This is where DFL candidate for Governor Mark Dayton is scheduled to vote later on this morning. Tom Emmer will vote later on this morning in Delano. And Independence Party candidate Tom Horner is scheduled to vote at 10 o'clock this morning in Edina. In our last half hour, we heard from the DFL party. This half hour, we are joined by Michael Broadcore, who is the deputy chair of the state Republican Party. Michael, thanks so much for taking a couple minutes uh, to be with us. First of all, I'm going to ask you the same question. How are you feeling today? We feel great today. We have great volunteers working across the state right now to get out the vote. We have the great candidates that are running, and we have a great message. Lower taxes, redesigned state government, uh, You know, having state government live within its means. We feel very good about our chances here on Election Day. What's the key to success today? Uh, having great candidates and a great field operation and a great get out the vote plan. We have can we have canvassers working all across the state right now, been working all throughout the night. We're going to make over a million get out the vote calls, tremendous volunteers and great candidates. We have a great candidate in Tom Emmer and other candidates running in the down ballot and in the uh, legislative races. It's a combination of things. We feel very good about our chances today. We've heard some Democrats are concerned about losing both the House and the Senate. Obviously, the DFL party has a solid majority in both the House and the Senate here in Minnesota. Do you think some of that, that national uh, disaffection could spill over here to Minnesota and benefit you? There's no question. Uh, Republicans haven't made gains in the legislature since 2002, and so we feel very good about our chances of picking up seats and getting very close, if not taking one, if not both, of the legislative bodies here in Minnesota. Today's going to be a very tough day for some Democrats. How about Tom Horner? What effect will he have? Small, if any. Um, a lot of voters went on a date with Tom Horner, but they decided not to marry him. The choice is between Mark Dayton and Tom Emmer, and Tom Emmer is going to win today. Michael Broadcore, thank you very, very much. Uh, most polls here in Minnesota will be open from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. We're live in Minneapolis this morning. Robert Moses, 5 Eyewitness News.